first of all, how, how excited were you just to be back on that carrier pitch? <laughs> It's been a long, long time since I've played and uh, it showed with my body and things like that. But it's great. It was, it was great and it was, a, it was a great cause as well. So, really pleased. Yeah, I was going to say, it's really obviously important the fight against dementia and football is coming together again against that. It's great. It's been uh, coming for the last, last, couple, last, ah, yeah, last couple of years and uh, now it's coming to the fore of things. And, and, and I think Big Chris has started it. Unfortunately, his dad had it. And then you look at the players like Ken Brown, uh, John Dean. And other people that, that, that always got it, and it's uh, hopefully we can get a little bit more out of it. Yeah, how pleased were you with the turnout? I think 1,400 people um, coming in and playing, and you know, is it a decent atmosphere? A decent atmosphere, great fun for 1,400 people to come out for a good cause. It's absolutely on a Sunday afternoon, late September. It's absolutely magnificent, and uh, can't thank Amanda for doing it. Yeah, I just wanted to ask you quickly about the, the current team. I think Tamer put a couple of goals off you now in the uh, the sort of goal scoring charts, what do you think of him as a player? Brilliant, absolutely brilliant. For someone to score, it doesn't matter what league he's, he's scoring and he's scoring goals, which is great. Uh, most of mine was done in the Premiership or Champions uh, cha Division 1 at the time. But no, fair play to him. Uh, takes, takes guts and things like what he's doing, and he's doing absolutely fantastic. Long may continue. And when you have a, a sort of record like that, is that anything you, you think about, or do you just feel the good more? Well, like, that doesn't bother me. I don't know how many goals I scored and how many appearances yeah. I I've made for Norwich, Glasgow Rangers, Chelsea, Reading. That doesn't bother me, that's all history. And it's, uh, it's nothing when you don't win nothing, which I've not, I haven't won anything in my career up down in England. I did in Scotland win the league in a couple of cups, but uh, down in England didn't, didn't win anything, so it doesn't count for me. Do you get back to, to watch games very often at all? Very seldom, very seldom. They're very kind to me when I come here, so I have a phone and I need tickets, they, they're straight away they give me tickets for a game, so they're very kind of Yeah, so yeah that's, that's something from speaking to a lot of the players that play today, that it's a really like, welcoming club in terms of its, it's legends and former players. Yeah, it, it hadn't been for years. There was an unwelcoming club a few years ago and then Simon Weber's came in and uh, he's done absolutely fantastic well and brought it back to the family club it used to be. Yeah. So he's got he's got to get take a lot a lot of praise for that and it's it's great and ex players want to come back and watch the football now. Last one for me, it's a, a great gesture for them to give you the pitch to play this game as well. It was originally scheduled to be at, at Norwich today. That's right. And they uh, fair play to Norwich again and we deserve big credit for it and hopefully next year it can get a little bit bigger and more people will come and yeah. we can advertise it a little bit more. But I'd like to thank Trevor Saunders for doing it. He's done a great job and absolutely magnificent and long may yeah. continue. Right, cheers, we're really